What's up guys? I'm Code Gray. Welcome to the channel. Oh, we finally got a reprieve in the weather. And you know I'm taking full advantage of it. This is very unusual. It's like December 28th. And we got up to 50 degrees. And the snow melted enough out of my driveway that I could safely get the bikes out. Uh, so I am definitely took the bikes out. Well, I'm, I'm starting with this one. This is going to be like kind of like a two-parter. Um, both bikes need gas since I have to start them once or twice a week throughout the winter because I don't store my bikes. Um, as you can see, I'm already low on fuel on this bike, so I'm going to get some gas, do a little bit of running around, get a little bit of riding time in on this one, and then we're going to take it back and we're going to go pick up the Rebel uh, because... Uh, I don't know if the wife's going to get home in time to take it out herself. By the time she gets home from work, it could be dark. I don't know if she'll want to take it out then. We'll see. But right now, we're going to start at the gas station. All right, gas is got. Now, as you can see, everything is very wet still. So, I will be taking it easy. All right, we got a couple errands to run. I'm gonna get those out of the way. And then, uh, in the meantime, I gotta think up a topic because I had no plans for a topic today. I wasn't even sure if I was gonna be able to get the bikes out or not. Wasn't sure if the driveway was gonna clear up enough. So we'll, we'll get errand number one out of the way. All right, errand number one done. Let's move on to errand number two, and I think I might have a topic in mind. So, the topic. Well, let's see. As I stated earlier, it uh, it's December 28th, so there's only a couple of days left in the year, so it might be a good time to do an end-of-the-year review for the Code Gray channel. I had some goals set for this year, so... Uh, I guess we should reflect a little bit and see if I actually accomplished any of the goals that I had for the channel this year. All right, let's start with goal number one. Uh, one goal I had for this year was to try and reach 500 subscribers by the end of the year. We're close. As of this morning, I'm like five subscribers away. But I gotta be honest with you guys, my, my goal for this channel isn't really to try and gain as many subscribers as, as I can. It's to make sure you guys are enjoying what you're watching. Yes, we'd all like to have more subscribers, but that's not the focus. Uh, the focus is making sure you guys are enjoying what you're watching. That's all. All right, we're almost at Aaron number two, so I better not get into the next uh, goal yet because I'll just end up cutting myself short. So let me stop for this Aaron, and then we'll pick it up right after that. All right, error number two done. Let's jump on the bike. Get on with goal number two. Oh, shit. Damn it. I did it. Put my gloves on before I get my key out. All right, goal number two. Now, the second goal that I wanted to accomplish this year was to ride a cruiser. Did I accomplish it? Yep. Yes, I did. As a matter of fact, that cruiser that I rode, you'll be seeing in the video here pretty soon in part two because... That cruiser that I rode happened to be the bike that my wife bought, which was a 2022 Rebel 500. Now, I've said it before, I'll say it again, real good bike. Great beginner bike, uh, good to last you quite a while, really. I mean, it all depends on what kind of power you're looking for, um, but I think it'll last you a while. So, real good bike. Now, completing that goal of riding a cruiser will lead me into goal number three, which was first rides. I was hoping to get a, at least a couple of first rides in this year of bikes that I haven't ridden before. And that is also, thanks to the Rebel, uh, I was able to accomplish that this year as well. 
um, Road the Rebel, like I said. And uh, thanks to my buddy Brian, he let me take a small ride on his uh, BMW S1000 RR, which if you happen to see in that video, I really like that bike. So, yes, I actually accomplished goal number three as well. I was able to do at least a couple of first rides this year. I would have liked to have gotten more in. Uh, this year was just kind of weird. Um, nobody was doing any kind of first rides. There was no one in my area doing group rides. You know, where you could go to, I shouldn't say group rides, I should say test rides. No one in my area, none of the dealerships were uh, had any, any kind of events to where you could go there and test any bikes. Not even the Harley dealership, and they're pretty well known for that. So I would have liked to have gotten more in this year, but at least I got a couple. All right, let's move on to goal number four. Now, my fourth goal for this year was to go on a group ride. And yes, I accomplished that as well. Now, granted, it wasn't a huge group ride. There was four of us. Before, still a group. Now this group ride, I also have to thank my buddy Brian again, because he was the one that invited me on it. Uh, this was our second time ever meeting up. And uh, yeah, he invited me along. It was a good time. I enjoyed it. I would have liked to have gone on more, but uh, kind of like the same problem with the first rides. There wasn't much going on in my area as far as group rides goes or, or big events or meetups. Um, there were events that were going on, but most of the ones that I found out about were like really far away from where I live. So it would have taken hours to get there, then do an event and then hours home. So uh, due to the way I work, my schedule being on the night shift, uh, I tend to miss some things due to that. So no, I didn't get to go on any more than one group ride, but hey, I accomplished the goal. I got to go on one. Now for my last goal, we're going to save that for part two. Um, we're going to go home, drop the CBR off, pick up the Rebel, get her gassed up. Then we're going to go over the last goal and a few other things that I'd like to talk about before we finish this video up. So stay tuned for part two. All right, we are back for part two. And we are back on the Rebel 500. And let me tell you guys, it has been a while since I've been on this bike. And man, it feels weird already. We'll be back used to it in no time. Give me a couple miles. But what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and get her gassed up. And then we'll get into our final topic. All right, we got the gas, and let's get into the final topic, or I should say the final goal of 2022. Now, my final goal is actually the same as my main goal for my channel overall since I started it. And my main goal for this channel was to meet a bunch of cool people who ride motorcycles and be able to have real cool, real good conversations with them and uh, just have some good, in good interaction. Now, let me tell you guys, I have accomplished that goal in spades. Now, I can't even begin to count how many people have gone out of their way to not only help me, but my channel out. Uh, just overall been very, very cool. Um, I mean, they've done stuff like shout outs, uh, mentions, all that good stuff. They've gone out of their way to give me really good advice. I mean, just overall, very good, very helpful, very cool people. Been invited into chat rooms. Uh, so I talk to a lot of you guys, not just through comments, but you know, through Instagram as well. And uh, everybody's been really cool this year. Well, actually, since I started the channel, everybody's been really cool. I also want to mention the abundance of positive comments that everybody's left. I think I said in my last year's recap video that I didn't have a single bad comment. Well, I can't say that this year. Um, but overall, I would say it's still probably 99% good. I think I've only had maybe a couple that 
kind of sticks out in mind but other than that it's been all good and I appreciate that guys all right that should pretty much cover the goals that I had for this year like I said I accomplished most of them I wish I could have done a little bit better on some of the goals I did accomplish but accomplished nonetheless I also want to say before I close this up that I really really appreciate everyone who has came by the channel left comments subscribed you know liked all that stuff um, I really appreciate it guys now I guess that's all that's left is to plan ahead for 2023 I'll have to uh, find some new goals to set and maybe add on to some of the ones I've already accomplished also I want to say before I wrap this video up is that uh, I'm not sure what day I'm gonna put this out so since I'm not sure I hope you have or had a very happy new year now if you enjoyed this channel and you like the content make sure you like subscribe hit that notification bell all right guys I'm wrapping this one up I'm code gray I'll catch you guys in the next one